Hey, what's up? I'm gonna give you one more for free. One more for free, all right? Unless you subscribe to Manus Nation. <laughs> all right, so I'm thoroughly warmed up. Did our warm up we just talked about. Did the first grouping uh, exercises, and that's for another time. So again, warmed up, ready to go. This next one's a cool one. Um, this is what I call the kettlebell double-handed swing, catch, squat, and then swing. This is a nasty, well, not nasty, but it's you don't see nobody, you don't see anybody doing this in particular. Um, you will see people swing and flip the bell. Swing, flip, swing, flip. We're gonna swing, catch, squat, catch, swing. I do recommend, if it's the first time doing this, easy weight, and number two, go outside, do it in the grass, or do it on rubber mats. If you do it on cement, you lose your focus, concentration, or just coordination predominantly, um, you're gonna drop the bell, and you know, I mean, I have broken horns before on bells that weren't quality, quality bells, so you know, that's neither here nor there, but just be mindful of that. So let's give it a shot. We're going to do, I'm doing five rounds of this. Six of the swing squat, swing cat squat, and then I'm gonna do 12 knuckle push-ups. So I'll do one round for you real quick. This is my second round, actually. Let's check it out. So let's give it a go. 70 pound, 32 kg. Let's go in with that swing. Catch, squat, catch, swing, catch, swing, catch, squat, throw back. It's a good movement, man. It's ballistic. And get you coordinated because you're catching that bell, getting ready to throw it back out to the seat. Boom, okay. And then we're going into those knuckles. Knuckle push-ups on the cement. Thank <laughs> you. 